The Transition Monitoring Group has expressed concern over the growing trend in Nigeria for political parties and candidates to mount litigations to stifle electoral processes and outcomes in the courts. It regards the electoral tribunals as key stakeholders in pre- and post-election matters and will be observing court cases to ensure Nigerians are aware of the outcomes of proceedings in the court and that the rule of law is maintained. Correspondent Habida Lawa reports. The regular conduct of elections has increased tremendously in Nigeria since the handover to democratic rule in 1999 and reforms over time have been instrumental in improving the conduct of elections. Recently, the Chief Justice of Nigeria, Tanku Muhammad, summoned the chief judges of six states over conflicting orders issued from their courts. While in some aspects arbitrating electoral disputes through litigation and resort to the rule of law is a step in the right direction, there are concerns about the adverse effect of litigation on the electoral processes and outcomes. This is especially in the context of nascent democracies associated with weak governance institutions, including the judiciary. Transition monitoring group says it is a welcome development for the judiciary to redeem itself. Threat to disrupt the fault, talks raising down electoral management offices, killing of security personnel, burning of police stations, and kidnapping of electoral officials. There is a pervasive atmosphere of uncertainty as when the government will address cases of budgetary kidnapping that have a the country and also tackle the problems associated with the criminal headsman. On insecurity, they demand that government should nip the security issue in the board and tow an acceptable and less divisive path of bringing a lasting end to the security challenges that presently bedevil the country. In conduct of security personnel, politicians, political parties during the election, TMG has observed wide report of misconduct by some security personnel, politicians, and political parties during election in Nigeria, and will observe closely and report accordingly the activities of this set of stakeholders to ensure compliance with Eastern electoral laws and regulation. There is a pervasive atmosphere of uncertainty as to when the government will decisively address the cases of banditry and kidnapping that are now rampant in the country. There's a nexus between security, social, political and economic growth and development of any nation. In Nigeria, they believe a change in governance approach will address most of the country's challenges. Habida Lawal, TVC News, Abuja.